Sparrow's Nest of Northwest Montana is necessary because we have children who are unaccompanied homeless high school students, which means they have no place, no fixed permanent residence in which they can call home. We've got kids that are under the radar and that are not in the system and that do need some help. All four of my children have gone through the school district here. All four of my children knew kids that were homeless, that were sleeping on couches or sleeping in cars uh, through the whole time that they were in school. And something that I had not realized had was going on in the valley. And back when my kids were going to school, my last one graduated six, seven years ago, um, it was not talked about a lot until a few years ago when somebody said something's got to be done and hence the creation of the of Sparrow's Nest to get something started. Sparrow's Nest is uh, extremely important in this day and age of homeless young people uh, who for one reason or another have no safe haven and this presents us with a, pro a possibility of at least helping a few uh, young people reach their um, dreams uh, through being able to finish school and go on to school. When you think of your or our impact on the community, what is the first word that comes to mind? Um, the first word that comes to mind is hope for the kids. It's taken a long time, but we've made a lot of progress. It's been slow, but sure, and we're, and we're getting there. Congregation of Sisters has always been involved with um, helping children and be, uh, have become very aware of the need for uh, helping our homeless children um, in other parts of the country, other parts of the world. So when I uh, heard that there was uh, a possibility of that kind of a problem here in um, Kalispell and in the Valley, I felt very um, moved to see what, how I could become involved. Sparrow's Nest itself, the influence that it has on me, um, is the need to be able to provide a space for these young men and young women so that they can continue through high school and not have to worry about where they're gonna be sleeping, eating, and staying.